Good afternoon, folks. Big Bo here with another great Class A motorhome value from Parkway RV Center. And folks, you're going to love this one today. This is a 2005 Itasca Sun Cruiser built by Winnebago. This is the Model 35A, three slide outs, only 29,000 miles. This thing is priced $10,000 under NADA base retail no options base retail and this thing's got plenty of options this unit's also certified so it's going to include a 90-day nationwide limited warranty and up to 138 point inspection by our certified rv techs to be completed after the purchase all of this for only 49.9 out the door there's no extra fees no extra fees for the warranty or the inspection that's the out the door price 10 grand under nada base retail i'll show you a print out here in a minute 36 foot long it's got the power awning all three slide outs have awning toppers in great shape this unit is built on the very popular workhorse chassis with the 340 horsepower 8.1 liter Vortec V8, the most powerful gas engine you could get in 2005. Folks, this unit is less than half price of what it costs new. And it's only got 29,000 miles, so somebody has lost a lot of money on this one, folks. Uh, one thing I like about Winnebago, I own, I've actually owned two, and I currently own one myself. One thing about Winnebago, folks, they actually manufacture 80% of their own parts. And this is very, very important. And I'll tell you why. Let's just say you buy this thing and two or three years from now you have a blowout and you damage this door right here. Well, guess what, folks? Most With most RV manufacturers, you're never going to find that door because they only keep parts for five or six years, model years back. But with Winnebago, Winnebago manufactures these doors. It doesn't matter if this thing's a 2005 or a 1975. You can tell them the VIN number off your coach, tell them which door it is, they'll send it to you. It's as easy as that, folks. That's the only brand that does that. You know, unless you get one that's three or four years old. Uh, so if you're going to get an 05 or something like that, Winnebago's a great choice because you're never going to have a problem getting parts for it. Winnebago's kind of sets a standard in their class. They're the only brand that actually builds their own aluminum frames in-house. They don't go to uh, the, the aftermarket vendors to get their frames to go on top of the chassis. They build their own in-house frames. This way they can control the quality of, of every Winnebago product. The slide-out system is designed just for Winnebago motorhomes from Lippard Components. They only build them for Winnebago motorhomes and they right to their specifications and it was designed by Winnebago engineers. Winnebago and Itasca are the only brands that have a standard fiberglass, no maintenance roof. You don't have to go up there and service it every year like you do with the other brands with a rubber roof. It's got all fiberglass. The awning has got the metal sun shield on it. It's got a basement air that's working right now. 5,500 watt on end generator that's running right now, running perfectly. It's a nice motor home, folks. It's 36 feet long, so it's not too big, not too small. That, that generator's running quite smooth. No delamination. Look at the striping and finish for the year model. Looks great. Of course, this is Winnebago slide out system with the trays that come out with the slide out so you don't have to duck underneath it to get to your outside storage. Let's see, Michelin tires. Of course, it's got the hydraulic leveling jacks that work great. Got the trailer tow package, the backup camera system. I'm gonna tell you, somebody's taking good care of this coach and it's only got 29,000 miles. I mean, you're saving a lot of money going with a used one over a new one. A lot of money. Uh, of course, the power awning, the awning fabric's in great shape. We've got to wash it, which we will do when we go through our checkout. But um, and there's no tears, no pinholes, nothing like that. Let's step inside this 35A Winnebago, a Tasca. I'm going to tell you folks, it's hot outside. It's 96 degrees today and it's nice and cool in here. It's at least, I'm going to guess 25 degrees cooler in here than outside and I've only had the air on for about 30 minutes. Folks, as we step inside here, I mean, you can tell this is not a cheap brand at all. This is a nice clean motor home. You walk in, you've got ceramic tile. 
you've got carpets that look brand new, you've got leather furniture, leather captain's chairs. You know, Winnebago actually builds their own furniture. Up here in the front, Sony camera system, only the best. Uh, you've got HD TV, surround sound, it's got a manual point satellite system, VCR, DVD player. Uh, 29,000 miles HWH hydraulic leveling jacks, heated power mirrors. Uh, it's got Winnebago's exclusive rear heat, and what that is is called a coach heater. What it is, it it's, it operates off the engine and it takes that wasted engine heat that normally just goes outside, and actually funnels it into a uh, into a heater so you can actually heat the back of this RV without having to run the furnace which I know right now 96 degrees you don't think of that but it will get cold and a lot of people buy Winnebago's just for that purpose right there so they can use them for cold weather camping without having to run their furnace so basically you can keep the bedroom heat hot with the engine heat and you've also got your dash heat up here to keep the front of it warm so a lot of times you can use this thing in the winter time uh, while traveling without having to use the furnace and another added benefit of that coach heat system it actually goes around the water heater so you get a free tank of hot water I'm gonna go ahead and lock this door folks because we get a lot of customers in and out uh, the both these front seats swivel for party seating uh, they're both leather in great shape this coach has only got 29,000 miles does not have any any signs of, of wear or anything on this coach. It's got day-night shades in all the windows. Winnebago's got their own cabinet shop. They put a glaze on these cabinets uh, to keep them looking new for way longer than the other brand's cabinets will. Um, got a leather recliner, sleeper sofa, and a table booth makes a bed. You've got the nice light fixtures. Another thing that Winnebago is known for for their roof is that they use a crowned roof. So there's no standing water on it. Let me show you something else, folks. And do this with any RV brand you look at and then do it to a Winnebago product. You're going to notice a difference. I know this sounds silly, but trust me, this, this really works. Punch the ceiling. You're going to notice when you do this to a Winnebago product over like a Fleetwood or a Coachman or for any, any of the other brands, folks. They're going to give a little. Not a, not a Winnebago. That's like punching a brick wall. You're going to notice a difference right off the bat. And I actually got that when I took the factory tour at Winnebago. Um, you know, they said you can tell the difference between a Winnebago roof and anybody else's by punching the roof. I know it sounds silly, folks, but if you do it, you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. Uh, you've got a fold-out table right here for extra counter space. And it just folds up into out of the way and then you've got some storage shelves underneath it some wicker basket storage uh, you've got Corian countertops Corian backsplash stainless steel microwave confection oven and a regular oven so you've actually got two ovens an electric and a gas oven uh, of course I know these look like miniature compartments but you actually open it up great place to put a coffee maker toaster oven or whatever and the other one over here has individual drawers for all your cooking utensils Plus, you've got plenty of storage in here. This is a should be a cutting board. And this one right here, of course, your cutlery drawer. And look how thick these cabinets are. I mean, this is a well-made coach, folks. Uh, you've got another counter extender right here. Residential style double sink. You've got a mowing faucet. Instead of the cheap plastic faucets like a lot of RV companies use, this has actually got the uh, the nice house style faucet. Little cabinets up here for your spices or whatever you want to put up here. You've got a stainless steel refrigerator freezer. And this one, if I'm not mistaken, should have the built-in ice maker. It does. Now, folks, what we do, and it's already getting cold. I mean, I can guarantee you that fridge is getting cold. Folks, what we do is we, like I said before, we go through a 138-point inspection on every RV we sell that's completed after purchase. And we go through virtually everything you can think of. Uh, now, there are a few things we don't cover. And so what I, instead of going over everything, which would take me several minutes, what I'm 
Go, what I do is I tell people to call us or email us, let one of our non-commissioned salespeople send you a copy of a blank checkout sheet so you can see how extensively we go through these RVs. I guarantee if you sat down with a pen and paper and made a list of everything you can think to check on an RV, it wouldn't be near the amount of things that we check on our RVs, folks. And we've been doing this for almost 50 years. We're well experienced. We've seen about every kind of situation you can think of. And unlike other RV dealers, folks, if we have to spend thousands of dollars to make an RV pass that inspection with flying colors, folks, we're going to do it. If we have to put an air conditioner or a refrigerator in it, we're not just going to patch it up. We're going to replace it. In other words, folks, when you pick this RV up after it's been inspected, and everything checked off on that list, you're not going to have any issues with it. And like I said, we're more than happy to send you a copy of it. You get that 90-day nationwide warranty uh, at no extra cost to you, and you can extend it very, very affordably. And folks, here's the book value on this RV. So you know I'm not just blowing smoke. Uh, now, this is no option. I know a lot of people like to take these NADAs and just mutilate them to death by adding all these crazy options that are standard equipment. You know, in 2005, when you bought this thing brand new, it was $140,000. You could not buy this unit without three slide outs. This particular floor plan, that's standard. But why do people add for slide outs? You couldn't buy this unit without an air conditioner. You could not buy this unit without a stove top, without a microwave, without a refrigerator, without a water heater, a furnace. Folks, but why do, you couldn't buy this unit without all those things, but why do people add all that stuff to the NADAs? Now, the slide toppers, they're an option. The manual satellite dish, that's an option. Other than that, folks, everything on this thing, and it does have a washer and dryer, that's not standard. You have to pay extra for that. So you would add that to your NADA if you wanted to. But folks, look at this right here. 2005 Atasca Sun Cruiser, 35A workhorse, three slides. Add adjusting for the mileage. $140,000 brand new. Cow, can you believe that, folks? The previous owners lost almost $90,000 and only drove it 29,000 miles. Folks, that's, that's almost $90,000 in savings that you're getting buying used over new. And, and now the 2017s are quite a bit more than the 2005s were. But folks, right here, average retail adjusting for the mileage is $59,290. No options, folks. Now, I can sit here and add three or $4,000 worth of options to it if I wanted to. But when you're that far under book on base retail, there's no need to. $49,995 or $49,9. We ran out of zeros on our stickers. So it's $49,9. Haggle-free price includes a warranty and the inspection. Now, folks, when I say haggle-free, if you wanted to take this RV with no inspection and no warranty, of course, we'll knock a little bit off the price since we don't have to do anything to it. But $49.9 includes the inspection, includes the warranty. Lowest price on the Internet, get online and Google 2005 Atasca Sun Cruiser 35A Workhorses. Look how many of them you find with 29,000 miles. The ones you do find with that low of mileage are ten, fifteen thousand dollars $15,000 higher than ours. And theirs don't include a warranty and an inspection unless you pay several thousand extra for it. So folks, this is if you're looking for a 2005 Atasca Sun Cruiser 35A, this is the lowest priced one on the internet. You can look, you're not going to beat this price, folks. Especially not with the warranty, the condition, and the mileage. And folks, I am going to do a 360 degree video tour. Make sure you go down to the item description. I'll have a link to that so you can see it from different angles than what you're seeing off this video. But folks, this unit is just exceptionally nice condition. We're going to continue our tour. Uh, 25,000 BTU uh, Coleman basement air conditioner so you don't have those air units on top um, of course it's got inverter it's got everything in the world you could think of on it folks water heater gas electric we're going to look here to the back you've got french doors leading into the private rear bedroom uh cory and top here at the sink medicine cabinet got the little fold down seat you can look around the skylight. There's no leak damage, no signs of water stains. They've obviously kept everything serviced. And even though this is a fiberglass roof, folks, you still have to go up there like any RV. And we just lost our generator, folks. I apologize about that. But like any RV, you can, uh, you have still have to maintain the roof by caulking around the skylight 
and anything stuck through the roof. Alrighty, folks, in here you got a private water closet, porcelain RV toilet, medicine, or not a medicine cabinet, but overhead storage. All this is enclosed in the side, and I'm going to try to continue this tour in the dark. Um, here in the back, private rear bedroom, Queen Island bed. Uh, this unit has got storage underneath the bed. Everything matches, got the bed spread. You got an HD TV. And a washer and dryer combo, and doesn't look like it's ever been used like most of them, but it is included. You know, if you had to add those, that'd be a couple of thousand dollars. Uh, you've got your own stereo back here. You've got, uh, of course, I can't show you right now because the power's off, but right, but you've also got a uh, adjustable mood lighting. So, you know, if you want to put a little Barry Manilow music on and, and get in the mood, this can do it. But anyway, folks, got some his and her reading lamps, uh, Wayne's molding, plenty of storage at the foot of the bed, big closets. It's a nice motor home, folks. And for this price, it's going to sell quickly. I mean, you get online, you look at these 05 Sun Cruisers, you're going to see this is the best deal out there. Especially when you consider the mileage and the warranty. This thing is a bargain at only $49.9. That's the out-the-door price. We don't add several thousand dollars in fees like other RV dealers do. Let me tell you something, folks. These RV dealers are getting worse and worse every year. Uh, what they do now is they add six or seven thousand dollars in fees on top of the sales price. That's why anytime you're dealing with an RV dealer, always get the out-the-door price. Not the advertised price, the out-the-door price, because you're going to be surprised how much higher the out-the-door price is over what they advertised it for. You know, what they do is they add a $800 prep fee, a $2,100 freight fee, a $395 dock fee, a $150 temp tag fee, a $500 tag and title fee. Folks, they add, and they just, they just keep going on with it. They come up with different names for them every year, but they're all 100% dealer profit. They're all completely unnecessary to purchase a used or new RV. So, folks, you know, walk out over the fees. If enough people do that, maybe these dealers will quit charging them, but you don't have to worry about that here. Folks, we got the lowest prices on the Internet. That's why we sell over 500-plus used RVs a year. We, uh, we've been in business for 48 years, since 1968, and, folks, I'm going to tell you, you don't stay in business that long. You don't sell that many RVs a year unless you're doing three things. First thing, you got to be selling a bargain because Internet shoppers, I promise you, folks, those of you looking at this, you're going to be shopping for this kind of motor home. You're going to be looking at several dealerships. So, obviously, if we're selling that many, everybody's doing their homework. They're coming to us because our prices are the lowest. Second, folks, we treat our customers right. You can look on my eBay feedback. I've got hundreds of positive feedback selling nothing but used RVs. We sell on about 20 different websites besides eBay. We use all the major sites. You can check out our Google Plus page. We've got dozens of positive customer testimonials from all over the United States. We've sold in all 50 states. And three, folks, we don't nickel and dime you to death. You know, you may remember when I was talking about the fees, we don't charge fees. If you finance an RV with us, folks, we don't mark interest rates up at all. Other RV dealers double the interest rate over what they get you approved for because the bank lets them keep the money. Bad thing about that is, folks, it makes your payoff go up more. It also makes it, uh, folks, where you're paying thousands of dollars more in higher RV payments over the life of an RV loan. Folks, we got our interest rate starting as low as 3%. You couldn't even buy this thing brand new for $140,000 and get a rate that low. And the reason why is other dealers mark interest rates up, we don't. We don't nickel and dime you with all these crazy um, services that they offer you in the closing office or the business office. When the finance manager is trying to talk you into signing the loan papers, Folks, they're going to hit you up with fabric protection, gap insurance, exterior protection package. All these stuff they're charging you, folks, you can get yourself for maybe one-fifth or one-sixth the price of what they're offering it to you for. All these dealership services they're offering you, folks, are marked up several times over dealer cost. They're adding that to your loan, making your payoff go even more, plus marking the interest rate up on top of that, so... 
folks, it's safe to say I see it every day. People come in here with RVs they've owned for several years that they finance, new and used, and they come in here, and because the dealer jerked them around, made them pay all this stuff, all these fees, marked the interest rate up, made them sign up for all these services that they never used, they owe $10,000, dollars 20000 more than their vehicle's worth. And I see it every day, folks, and it makes me mad. And I know this is more of a rant than a fact, but if you look on there, you're going to, you're going to see horror stories of people who, who buy RVs. They owe, they, they've been paying on it for two or three years. They still owe more than what they paid for it brand new. I mean, I seen it the other day, folks. Guy paid 20% down, got hooked into buying all those services, the extended warranties and all that stuff. Never used any of it. And he came in here, he's been buy, he's been paying on it for three years, wanted to trade it in on a motorhome, and he was he owed more than what his unit listed for brand new because of all that other stuff. After paying 20% down, thanks to all of those fees and services that he got hooked into hooked into paying for, folks. And don't don't fall victim to that. The only thing by law you're required to pay for is the sales price and any applicable sales tax, which you only have to pay when you're buying in the same state you live in. Like we're a Georgia dealer, so all Georgia residents have to pay sales tax. If you come from out of state, you'll pay your sales tax when you title the RV at your local DMV office in your home state. Folks, we keep things simple, we keep things inexpensive, and that's why we're still here and going strong after almost half a century. We're one of the most successful largest and oldest independently owned family ran used rv dealerships in the country we don't sell new folks when you buy one of these brand new let me tell you a secret i don't care what kind of rv you buy whether it's a motor home a diesel gas c class b class a class travel trailer fifth wheel toy hauler hybrid pop-up it doesn't matter folks when you take that rv off that new dealer's lot it doesn't matter if you take it 50 feet down the road, do you turn, bring it back, offer to sell it back to them. You lost 33% of what you just paid for it. I don't care if you paid $500,000 for it. You lost a third of that in five minutes. That's why you never win by buying you. Like this unit right here, It's this unit's 140 grand new. I've got it for 49.9 with 29,000 miles with a warranty. We're going to guarantee everything to work on that inspection sheet. And that does include the generator. I knew the gas level's a little bit low on it, and I was afraid it would cut out. So, and it did. Uh, but we will put fuel in it. We're going to run that generator for 24 hours straight when we do our checkout, make sure everything works perfectly. And, folks, I'm going to tell you, you're doing all this, getting all these services for no extra charge, and paying and saving, God, folks, you're saving ninety thousand dollars buying this RV over buying a new one. Just doesn't make sense to buy a new, does it? So give us a call. Drop at 706-965-7929 evenings and Sundays. You can get sales help at 423-605-6747. You can visit our website, parkwayrvcenter.com. We've got 150 plus used RVs in stock. More arriving every day. Now, folks, I don't have everything posted online, so I always tell everybody, if you don't see what you're looking for on the website, call, talk to one of my non-commissioned salespeople. That's right, folks, they're non-commissioned. There's no sales pressure, no games, no gimmicks. There's none of the reasons here that you hate buying from a commissioned salesperson, not to mention how much money that saves you, too. You never think about this, folks, but when you go to a place that uses commissioned salespeople, they get paid a percentage of the profit that the dealer makes. So they, in the average commission rate is 25% of the gross profit. So what that means, when you go to a dealer that uses commission salespeople, 25% of their markup, they have to mark their units up an additional 25% to cover the salesperson's commission. When it comes to dealing with the salesperson, every dollar they get out of you is an extra 25 cents in their pocket. So they're very hard to deal with. If you've got a trade in, a lot of people don't know this, but let's say the, the trade in value is 20 grand. They talk you into taking 15 for it. Do you know that they get paid commission on how far under trade value they get get you to take for your trade in? That's an extra $1,250 in commission that you're paying that salesperson, folks. The, the dealership doesn't pay them. You pay them by paying thousands more for the same RV you can buy here for thousands less. Don't believe me? Get online. Just compare our prices. You're going to see what I'm talking about, folks. Warranty, 
no extra fees, out the door price. And for a motor home that you can buy for $49.9, you're going to spend sixty grand, sixty-five grand at another RV dealership without a warranty. And then they're going to add several thousand dollars in fees that we don't charge. So safe to say we're saving you $15,000. And that's why people come from thousands of miles away to buy from us. We've sold in all 50 states, including Alaska and Hawaii. We've sent over 2,000 RVs all over Canada, coast to coast. We've sent over 30 overseas to England, Italy, Australia, the Netherlands, and other countries because of our prices, folks. Even after transportation and traveling expenses, you're still saving a lot of serious money. And plus getting a nice trip out of it, too. We'll pick you up for free at the Chattanooga, Tennessee Airport. During business hours, we have several customers a week that fly in. If you want to rent a car to get to us, we'll help you drop the car off at the local rental car terminal here in town. And if you want to buy a tow dolly, we sell those at cost, and we don't sell them to the general public. We only sell tow dollies to the people that buy RVs from us. We sell them at cost so you can tow your own car back if you want to. So we'll help you out any way we can, folks. Uh, we can save you some money. Give us a call, 706-965-7929. Uh, evenings and Sundays, 423-605-6747. Uh, our website, again, is parkwayrvcenter.com. And like I said, folks, make sure you click below to see the 360 video. Thank you for watching. Look forward to seeing everybody here in beautiful Ringgold, Georgia.